Starting from 1960, like clockwork every four years, all of Europe immerses itself in the passionate atmosphere of football. Across 17 UEFA European Championships, numerous football legends have shone brightly on this stage. In the history of football, exceptional players have graced the European stage, making it no easy task to select the greatest Euro Efiend of all time. In 2016, UEFA officially announced the greatest Euro Efiends based on the votes of 3.8 million fans on their official website. Now let's take a look at the legendary lineup of the greatest Euro players. John Luigi Buffon, with an impressive 19 years of experience representing the Italian national team, Buffon played 157 matches. Although he never clinched a European championship, this goalkeeper, affectionately known as the Spider, was a key factor in Italy's 2006 FIFA World Cup victory and their runner-up finish in Euro 2012. Buffon's peak years saw him as the impenetrable shield guarding Italy's goal, making him a deserving inclusion in this list. Philip Lahm. Lahm participated in three Euros, playing 113 matches for the German national team. Despite winning the 2014 World Cup, this versatile defender narrowly missed out on a European title in 2008 when Germany fell to Spain in the final. Standing at just 1.7 meters tall, Lom's slender frame belied his ability to outwit taller and faster strikers throughout his career. Known for his intelligence on the field, he never received a red card, a testament to his discipline. Pep Guardiola once described Philippe Lom as the smartest player he had ever known, highlighting his excellence. Paolo Maldini. Over his illustrious 24-year career, Maldini played 126 matches for the Italian national team across three Euros, 1988, 1996, and 2000. Despite never lifting the European Cup, he was individually honored in the Euro 1996 and 2000 Best Exe, an accolade earned even as Italy lost to France in the final. Maldini's left-back position complements Lam's right-back role in this lineup. Carles Puyol, the Spanish defender featured in 100 matches for the national team. Puyol's crowning moment came in Euro 2008 when Spain defeated Germany 1-0, with Fernando Torres scoring the decisive goal. Unfortunately, injury kept him out of the 2012 squad defending their title. Puyol embodied strength, energy, courage, fair play, and exemplary sportsmanship. He remains an icon and legend for both Barcelona and the Spanish national team. Franz Beckenbauer. If Pelé was the king of football, Beckenbauer was the emperor, not only of German football, but also the global game. One of the greatest defenders in history, he played 582 matches for Bayern Munich and won top honors in German football as both player and coach. Known as the Kaiser for his elegant playing style and exceptional leadership, Beckenbauer secured not only World Cup victories, but also European glory in 1972. He twice claimed the Ballon d'Or, solidifying his status as a football legend. In the midfield, Andrea Pirlo would play in the deepest position among the three midfielders. Pirlo may not be the fastest runner, excel at heading, or possess great physical strength, but what sets him apart in a world of athletic players is his brain. Watching Pirlo glide effortlessly across the field, orchestrating the ball like a grandmaster on a chessboard, is a sight to behold. With 116 appearances, Pirlo ranks fourth in Italy's national team history. He showcased his exquisite qualities during Euro 2012, where his exceptional ball distribution in the central midfield area made him Italy's standout performer. Prior to that, in Euro 2004 and 2008, Pirlo was a key player for the Italian squad. His contributions also extended to Italy's World Cup victory in 2006. Playing slightly higher in the midfield trio would be an Iniesta with a knack for unlocking defenses. He played a pivotal role during the golden era of Tiki Taka. The Barcelona legend earned 107 caps for the national team, scoring 13 goals. His international success includes back-to-back -back European championships in 2008 and 2012. After Iniesta's retirement, it's unlikely that football will produce another player as intelligent as he was. Completing the midfield trio is Zinedine Zidane, one of the finest players in Euro history. The former Real Madrid coach excelled in Euro 1996, 2000, and 2004. 
Euro 2000 stands out as his most memorable tournament. The French superstar had a perfect career at both club and international levels, with his pinnacle being the 1998 World Cup triumph. Zidane's artistry on the field remains an enduring source of inspiration. On the right wing in this lineup, we have Cristiano Ronaldo. The Portuguese forward boasts nearly 200 appearances for the national team, with an impressive 130 goals. At 39 years old, Ronaldo holds a plethora of records. He is the top scorer in Euro finals with 14 goals and has the most appearances in the tournament's history. His individual accolades include two Golden Boot Awards, 2012 and 2021. Even in team achievements, Ronaldo led Portugal to victory in Euro 2016. Simply put, his legacy in European championships is unparalleled. Taking the left wing position is Thierry Henry. The French striker is a true Euro legend, contributing to France's successes in 1998 and 2000, both continental and global triumphs. Henry played 123 matches for the national team, scoring 51 goals. His three goals in Euro 2000 were crucial to their campaign. For loyal Arsenal fans, the name Thierry Henry evokes memories of a powerful, elegant, lightning-fast forward who graced the Premier League with golden moments. The last player on the list, and a great center forward not only for Dutch football but also for the global game, is Marco van Basten. He scored 24 goals in 58 appearances for the vibrant Orange Netherlands team during Euro 1988. Van Basten played a pivotal role in helping the Dutch team clinch the championship. His total of five goals included a memorable hat trick against the England team in Euro 1992. Despite missing a penalty shootout in the final against Denmark, Van Basten rightfully earned a place in the tournament's best XE. In this lineup, we also have legendary super substitutes, such as Dino Zoff, the goalkeeper for the Italian national team, Matthias Sammer, the central defender for the German national team, Pepe, another central defender representing Portugal, Xavi Hernandez, the midfield maestro from Spain. Luis Figo, the Portuguese midfield wizard. Michel Platini, the French forward. Gerd Muller, the German striker. That completes the lineup of the 11 greatest legends in Euro history. If you have a favorite among these names, feel free to comment below the video. And now, let me bid you farewell until our next encounter in future videos.